Hi, what's up everyone and welcome back to my channel or if you're new, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. And if you're not yet subscribed, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below and the bell notification before you leave so that way the next time I upload a video, you won't miss it. So for today's video, I have the new Revolution Friends, Friends X Revolution palette. And it looks like this. This is the outside packaging. And I also got the Monica palette. And I love this with the door peephole frame. And I also got the Monica lipstick. And I did already open it. And of course I don't know how to open packaging to keep it nice. But So I got these three. And so I figured we can take a look at them and review them and do a look with it. And I figured we could do the look with this. We could do swatches or something with this. Maybe just take a look at it and maybe swatch just a couple. And test out the lipstick. So... Let's take it out. And I love this packaging. I love it, love it, love it. Look at it. It's gorgeous. Now it's in like the metal tin type packaging. And, and it opens up. It has like these clasps right here. And it actually folds, which is awesome completely. So, and it, I, this palette is gorgeous. It's got a lot of neutral colors, some pinks, some purples. It's got this really pretty green, like a grungy fall green. I don't know if that's coming off green or not, but this is gorgeous. It's got a lot of neutrals, and I love the names. It's just got every character's name. Um, all the main characters are up here. It's got Ross. Chandler, Joey, Monica, Rachel, Phoebe. And then we have Gunther, Janice, Carol, Ben, Emma, Richard, Emily, Ursula, Mr. Geller, Mrs. Geller, Julie, Barry, Marcel, of course, Marcel, Paolo, Mike, Mindy, and Frank. And then we have these three highlight shades. That is Ugly Naked Guy, Mr. Heckles, and Estelle. And these are beautiful. I love this highlight. The Ugly Naked Guy. Maybe we will take a look. Let's. I'm. I, I'm very intrigued by the 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 Ross shade. And let's take a look. I'm. Ooh, and it's, they're soft. Very soft. That's Ross. Um, let's try. I love this, the Phoebe color. And definitely this Ursula. Ursula. Phoebe. Ross. Let's try one more. How about Frank, which is a yellow, that yellow shimmer. Let's swatch them. Just set it down. Oh, I love that orange. So these are the four swatches. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Nice. So, let's swatch a couple more. I want to try like the pinks. A couple pinks. We got Julie, which is this brighter pink. Joey is a lighter pink. Which is odd that they chose a pink for Joey. Let's try. Okay. We gotta do it. Monica. 
and Emily. Let's swatch these. Okay, so this is what they look like. Of course, I can't swatch very well, but that's what they look like. Very pretty. Very, very pretty, these shades. So now I'm just... So I'm going to do a look. Um, I'm going to do like a fall-esque type look. And this, like I said, this orange is definitely calling my name. And I love that this has such a beautiful large mirror. Sorry. Um, so, I'm going to first actually go in and use the shade Carol, which is like this light orangey neutral shade right here. And go use Carol. We're just gonna test this out. Now I already I just used uh concealer on my eyes. I like the the it's a nice crease color. Very good. It's so I got a story I gotta tell you guys about this getting how I got this palette and what happened. So, it all started with earlier in the week before it actually came out. I went there because I checked on the Ulta website. I'm sorry. By the way, I got this at Ulta. <laughs> um, so I went on the Ulta website and it said it was available in the store. So, I went there before work and I said, do you guys, I asked if they have it. Oh, no, no, it's not uh, on yet. I'm like, okay, well, I'll be back in a couple days. It said it was supposed to be here. She said, no, we haven't had it. Okay. So I went back yesterday, which was Friday for, so I went back. Well, first, before I went back, I called them and I asked them if they had it in stock yet. And she's like, oh, yeah, we have it in stock, but we haven't been able to put, we haven't put it out yet. I'm like, okay, well, when are you guys putting it out so I can get it? She goes, well, we could hold it for you. I said, okay. So, I did, I, and I just wanted her to hold mainly this one. So, and, I, and she's like, oh, we don't have any in stock. She said, we only got one one in stock. I'm like, what do you mean you got one, just one in stock? She's, but I'm like, so you have it? She goes, no, one of us bought it. I said, but you haven't been able to put it out on the shelf before anyone can buy it, but somebody one of you you guys, the employees, bought it, right? She said, yeah. I'm like, that doesn't seem very fair. So, she, so she's like, well, oh, hang on. Let me see what we have. So she goes, checks. They had, she goes, oh, my manager found one more on the bottom of a, a box. I'm like, okay, well, hold that for me. Because I will be there in a little bit. Okay. Now tell me. Tell me how, how you you try to go and say that you don't have any and you only got one in and then somebody, an employee bought it before it was, they even were able to put it out on the shelf. Doesn't seem fair. So then I go in and I go down the aisle where the makeup revolution is and they had it all set out with the small palettes. So, I grabbed the Monica set because they were all out of the Rachel lipstick. So I wasn't going to get the Rachel palette if I couldn't get the Rachel lipstick because that's just me. And then I ended up not just 
passing on the Phoebe set. So, that's why I got the Monica and this one. So, that's my story about how, about getting this palette. So now I'm going to go with this, that Phoebe shade. Go figure. This is pigmented. Yeah, and I can really tell that it is got some pigment to it. Like it's Oh my god, I love this shade. I'm loving this shade. It's gorgeous. This orange I'm just going in right here in the crease, the outer part of the crease, and it's just kind of brightening it up. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit, just a little bit. Okay, there you go. This is such a gorgeous... I'm just going lightly with it, like... It's weighty too. This palette is weighty, weighted. So like holding it, it's kind of heavy, but it's nice. I really like it. There's got a lot of kick up to it, but there's not a lot of fallout though. Once it, it's, which is nice. I'm going to go back in with that orange. So I went in to the crease with the shade Carol. And then I went in to the outer part of the crease with or Phoebe, which is a gorgeous orange. I'm loving that orange. Um, so, one, two. Go in and use that green, the Ross shade. to wash my brushes guys and I'm going to actually use this green like this is so pretty and I am I'm, I like the green and the orange together it definitely says fall and fall, definitely has a beautiful fall-esque vibes to it. I'm not doing a cut crease. I'm doing something simple because we all... Ooh, now it's getting some fallout. So we could just rest it off. That's okay. So this green has a little bit of fallout. But... I'm just putting the green all over on the lid. Okay. Oh, 
know if you guys can see that or not. So, and then one last shade. I think I'm going to go in with, let's try this. I'm going to go in with this Rachel. I'm just going to put it right here in the inner corner. Let's do something else. And then I'm going to go in with the pal this shape Paolo on my lower lash right underneath. Because, oh yeah. That's gorgeous. Gorgeous. I'm loving it. This is like... Beautiful. Beautiful. And then I'm just gonna blend it all together. Kind of blend that that orange a little more. Go dip in. So this is the look. Let's just pop on some eyeshadow or some mascara. I already have eyeshadow on, and then we could take a look. At the lipstick, we could see how what that looks like on, and we'll do some swatches of the Monica palette, just a few, and I'll let you know what I think. So let me know if you're planning on picking up anything from this collection. Let me know if you guys watched Friends and what what are some of your favorite um, episodes, if you can remember, or do you still watch it? Because I know I certainly still watch it. Um, yeah. Or just some favorite moments of your of Friends. Now... I'm going to you try this highlight, this ugly naked guy, because that's what I want. I want an ugly naked guy on my face. Ugly naked guy on my face. <laughs> just kidding. But I want the shade on my face. So let's just. I'm just gonna go in. Yeah. Very pow. It's powdery. I must say this palette is powdery in. Oh, beautiful. It's very nice. Do you see that shine? Oh, my God. Okay. I'm going to use my viewfinder to... So the only downside I can say about this palette is that it's heavy, but most people would be put, set, setting it on a table or a counter or whatever while they're doing it. But if it has a mirror or they can have it sitting, whichever. But so I don't really see that as a major thing. Well, I love this look. 
I love the colors. It's very powdery though. Used it once and it's like, looks like I used it a half a dozen times at least. So that is that. Now let's take a look at this lipstick. Now I got the in the Monica shade. And it looks like this. It says Monica. You know, I think all the Rachel lipsticks were sold out because that's probably a more common name, I would guess. I do have, I know people named Rachel. So you would think that anyone with the name Rachel would get a lipstick with their name on it. Because why not, right? And I love this at the top. Look at that. Almost, I don't know, I just love that. So, that's what that looks like. And it also does on the cap say Friends X Revolution. And this is the color. It's a gorgeous color. And again, I don't know if you could see it. Right there. It's got the little lip on it. So let's try this out. Open up the palette again. Okay. This is definitely like a pinky nude, which is beautiful. Beautiful. It's... And the formula is okay. I mean, it's... It's not like a cre super creamy. It's got a little bit of creaminess to it. But it's not like... Not... It's not hard or anything, It's but it's not like super creamy or anything. I guess, I don't know, it's been a while since I've actually used an actual lipstick, but I definitely enjoy this. This I love this color. So yeah, that's that. And also, we have the Monica palette, of course. Now let's, I'm going to just swatch it, do my best swatching it right here and we'll just see what it, now it looks like this of course and it's got a small mirror and this is what the palette looks like it's definitely a neutral shade it looks like it has a, a shimmer a couple shimmers a glitter and the rest are um mattes now let me see if i can take this plastic off okay there we go so oh yep one two Maybe three shimmers. So we got a shade called Clean, Chef, and Geller Cup. Ooh, that is beautiful. Okay. That clean shade is not really showing up, but it'd be a gorgeous highlighter. Oh, that orange, that Chef shade is beautiful. And the red, that red shade. Where are we? So we have that. And then we have the shades chicken. And that's another very neutral, just can barely even see it shade. Um Let's see, we got shade Twins, which, okay, it's, it looked like a glitter, but it's not really a glitter. I don't know, it's, oh, this is like, it, okay, it's like a glitter. It's just, wasn't picking up like a glitter, but it's.
it's that see and let's try frizzy and of course my arm where is my arm there we go that brown right there and then I'm gonna do the last three on this arm just we got Bing or you know who Chandler Bing Bing oh my god obsessive these are like I said these are very neutral it's a nice beautiful neutral palette and I mean it's got color like the pink peaches and the reds and that orange that orange is so gorgeous that shade chef look at that so that is that I do love this even though it's more of a neutral and I am not much of a neutral person but and you I can I can use it it's fall colors I love it um yeah so this is definitely gonna be on my display up here with everything I and it will definitely get used it's not gonna be just a decorative piece I am loving this so this is gorgeous and I am excited I am going to be working on getting the mirror so if I ever do get a hold of that mirror you will definitely be seeing it that on this channel all the time <laughs> so that is that so I hope you enjoyed I hope you guys can get a hold of it these this palette probably more likely on the Revolution website or maybe the Alta website might not have a good chance of getting it in store if all stores were only getting a couple of these in or if the employees were buying it first so that is that but I hope you enjoyed and if you like these kinds of videos of reviews or first impression type videos and um, I also do unboxings so if that interests you please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't yet and i guess that's it have a great day